the sun my heart is beating like a drum hey love you look so beautiful tonight i see the stars are in your eyes if you could see the way they shine hey love you look so beautiful tonight when i'm with you this world is brighter oh love you shine take me and say Tell me there will come a time when your heart and mine will grow cold. No more staring at the evening sky, though in places high. Say the future is our enemy. Time eventually set the sun. But I believe in you, and you believe in me. I'll to you, Jordan, take Katie to be your lawfully wedded wife. As I do. Will you honor and keep her in sickness and in health? I will. For richer and for poorer. I will. For better or for worse. I will. In sadness and in joy. I will. To have and to hold. I will. To love and to cherish. I will. Forsaking all others, keeping yourself only unto her till death. I will. Do you, Katie, take Jordan to be your lawfully wedded husband? I do. Will you honor and keep for richer and for poorer, I will. For better or for worse, I will. In sadness and in joy, I will. To have and to hold, I will. To love and to cherish. So in the hours of the darkest kind, when 
You said I love it to me And I don't know what that means So I froze on my feet People use it so carelessly And I couldn't believe That you were diving so deep And you said perfectly Everything I'd been feeling about you It's time to break the chains that For those of you who don't know me, I'm Erin, the bride's sister and built-in best friend. Let's be honest though, half of you here have probably mistakenly called me Katie at one point in my life. <laughs> when I first sat down and started to think about what I wanted to say tonight, I kept thinking to myself, wow, I can't believe Katie's getting married in less than an hour. Um, <laughs> I'm kidding, but I did rewrite this speech about 50 times because I simply cannot put into words how much I treasure and adore our relationship. Katie, you're my best friend and other half. Growing up, I always wanted to be just like Katie, whether it was stealing her clothes and makeup like any younger sister, to doing quite literally everything she told me to do. From Christmas concerts we put on into the basement to filming music videos on your laptop, growing up without you would never have been the same. Um, Katie, I admire your dedication to everything you do. You never fail to make me laugh and tell me that everything is gonna be okay in the end. I'm so thankful God made us sisters because I couldn't imagine growing up without you. When I first met Jordan, I knew he was the one for Katie. To know Jordan is to know the meaning of a true friend. He's there for everyone and is always the first one to offer help. You're always down for tubing up north, even though, let's face it, you aren't the best swimmer. I hope one day Katie can finally teach you how to float in water. I couldn't think of a more perfect person for, for my sister, and I know you're going to take great care of her. Katie and Jordan, I love you two so much. You know how to pick each other up and make each other laugh. I'm so proud of you two for how much you have grown together, and I know God has so many blessings coming your way. With that being said, I'd like everyone to toast to Katie and Jordan's long and beautiful life together. Nate, Jordan's oldest brother. This guy behind me here is AJ, the middle son. We're both honored to be serving here today as Jordan's best men. Being Jordan's oldest brother means we've been around pretty much his entire life. We've, we've witnessed some major accomplishments in his life. We have. These accomplishments include graduating from college from SVSU. Go Cards. Purchasing a home. Big step. Getting a full-time job. Joining a fire department. Pretty proud of that. We've had the privilege of watching Jordan grow into one of the best men that we've known aside from our dad. 
Of all the people I've countered in my life, Jordan's probably the most patient, caring, laid-back people I've ever met. The kid doesn't get mad about anything. Kind of makes me mad he doesn't get mad. Back in our childhood memories, Jordan's kind of amazing he lived to see this day. Since Jordan was the youngest brother, he hadn't endured years of mine and AJ's. He was basically me and mine and AJ's personal crash test dummy. There were times of living room wrestling when mom and dad weren't around, convincing you to launch yourself off the couch. There were the days of the backyard baseball. Watch him step in the batter's box against one of us, only to catch an inside pitch in the ribs. Due to the constant beatings George took as the youngest, he had no choice but to be tougher. You're welcome. First, make spending time together a priority. Just keep dating. Keep it that dating mindset. Enjoy each other's company and have fun experiencing life together. Never go to bed angry and cherish the happy moments, but know that marriage will always have its tough and challenging times. In trying times, remember why you chose each other in the first place. Love and appreciate them. Do the little things to show them how much they mean to you. Over the course of the last three years, through the time we have spent together, I know that all of these hold true for you too and you have a great foundation for a great relationship. And on that note, I'd like to welcome Katie to the family. I found a love for me Darling, just dive right in and follow my lead I found a girl beautiful and sweet I never knew you were that someone waiting for me Cause wise men say Only fools rush in But we were just kids when we fell in love Not knowing what it was I will not time darling just take my hand take my whole life too hey! you, you are something beautiful floating through my mind like you do To see her everything or not Everything I'm not Sugar, you yeah. 